friends, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. Guys, today I am coming to you guys with a huge, huge fall home decor and entertaining haul. So if your area has been as hot as it has been here in Georgia, you are about ready for the fall. And so I am planning, fingers crossed, for some things to happen here in the next couple of weeks when the weather begins to cool off a little bit. Those are the times where I really wanna be outside and those are the times I think where we kinda dress the best. So, with that being said, I have items here for home decor, um, home like maintenance i have things for home entertaining i just have a lot of things from ross from amazon from home goods from wall not walmart from sam's from brand smart from bath and body works from ikea oh my from dollar tree did i say ross <laughs> yeah ross and yeah so with no further ado Let's go ahead and get started. One other thing I have, and I'm going to start with that. So, a couple of weeks ago, I had a video on here, and I shared, um, what was it? I think it was like some things that were currently on sale that I thought were must-haves for, um, for your home and for this upcoming season if you missed that video i'm gonna put it here in the i card you need to go and see it because i had some good stuff in there and i um, some of the things that i listed are also in my amazon store so i on that video i stated that we were talking about mackenzie childs and i was telling you guys that there was this certain mackenzie childs kettle that i wanted and it was out of stock until october and i um, had gone on William Sonoma. I told you guys about how you can get some McKenzie Childs things off of HSN and um, when they have them on sale. And I was talking about how how many times I had picked up the kettle and I talked myself out of it. Not because I couldn't afford it, because I could. It was simply because at the time, you know, I was like, well, I could get this, this, and this instead of me paying just like this one price on this one thing. And so you guys heard that um, video. You saw that video. And so if you saw my girlfriend V, V took a trip to New York and she heard that, um, she heard, of course she heard me. And I was like, so she was like, um, she was going to New York, some of the places that she might go to, whatever. And she mentioned Mackenzie Childs. And I said, well, if you should go um, and you see it, because it's a particular kettle that I want. I didn't want the regular kettle. I wanted the kettle that had the gold bird on the top. And that one is um, it's like a limited one. And so that's the one that I wanted. And so she was like, if I go, I'll let you know, whatever. So V called me when she was up there and she was like, they don't have it. They, they, they don't have it. And I'm, I was like, oh, okay. Because I told us if you saw it and they had it at the actual store, get it, I'll send you the money. Well, of course she told me they didn't have it. And then she was like, then she goes on and she's like, oh, but she saw this one and this one and whatever. Okay, fine. So 
Days go by and what arrives at my doorstop? Let me tell you. And I almost missed it because you guys know that my brother is always getting packages here and I thought it was that. So at my door, I got this. <laughs> Isn't she beautiful? This is the Mackenzie's Child's black and white check. This is the, um, what is this one? I want to make sure I get this right because this is so beautiful. Okay, so this one is the Courtly Check Enamel Three Quart Tea Kettle with Bird. And this is what it looks like. This, it is so pretty guys. It is gorgeous. Now you guys know that I wanted the gold bird. One, because I have a lot of the accents and it actually came from the McKenzie Childs um, warehouse. You have to go into the store um, to actually order this one. You can't order this one. It won't be available until later October. And it's sort of like, it's not like the one that everybody else has. Of course not, because that's not your girl. And this is what it looks like. It has the beautiful black and white check design that is timeless. It has the gold bird. And I wanted the gold bird because I have a lot of the um, Michael Elm inspired um like the bowls and the spoons and things like that and i thought this would be perfect for that um the handle here is wooden and then this is like a brass type gold it is absolutely beautiful it has the pour spout here and it is heavy it is heavy so when you look at this you would actually have may have thought that it was um, porcelain but it's not it is cast enamel these are items that you will have um, for generations to come they last forever and they maintain their beauty now there is another one that I am going to get look at that can you see that right there yeah there's another one that I'm going to get and um, but yeah you guys gonna have to wait to see about that one. But this is gonna look amazing on my stove. I can't wait to put it there as well as to have my first cup of coffee in this beauty. She is absolutely gorgeous. So I wanna first thank my girl V for traveling all the way to Manhattan and hearing what your girl was saying because I actually thought that I was going to have to wait until October, November to get it. And so now I have it early. Thank you very much. You know, when I uh, saw the box, I screamed and then I called her to thank her. So she got that for me. Thank you very much, girlfriend. You know, I love you. That's one who always has my back. If I say I'm looking for something, she, she nine times out of 10, she found, she's already found it. Like, why you need to go here? It's her, Gigi, and it's a couple of you guys who've like, when I say I'm looking for something, I can't find this, I, it never fails. Y'all sent, you either gonna send it to me or you're gonna tell me, look, I saw it here. Go look here. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. All right, so that is actually friend mail okay so the next place we want to go because i only huh, let's go let's do the amazon things okay so amazon i'm getting like different types of accent pieces that i want to style the house with for the fall amazon is a great place guys to go and just to see what they have because nine times out of ten but something you've seen in the store you will be able to find it on Amazon. So, the accent pieces that I want to use this year, I am going to use things, some things that I had for the previous year, and I'm gonna 
transition them over to the fall and they're go we're going to switch it up that's what i try to do here i don't feel like it's you, you have a need to go and buy a whole bunch of things to try to recreate a look because nine times out of ten you have a lot of things that can transition to the following season and you can also use some things that you use for the for the from the previous season the previous fall season and it would look and you can make it work in this season just add a couple of pieces kind of change up your color whatever 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 main color you may have used look for a complementary color and that will totally change the look that is exactly what i do i don't try to spend a lot of money on little um small accent type things because they collect a lot of dust and they become very knickknacky you don't see a lot of those things here but what you do see is like the big pieces is what i'm usually focusing on so that being said one thing that i picked up from amazon were these black candlesticks here so you see they are three levels small medium and um large well tall small and medium and this is what they look like they're very pretty nice like bl um brushed black metal it has a little bit of, of a shine it's not matte these were a um, great price i think the three of these were actually 12.99 these will definitely be down in my amazon store if you are interested in this i have an upcoming video also to, um about some um the trends upcoming trends for the fall um the, or some elements that you can add to your home make sure you guys come back um for that video because i know it's going to be very 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 beneficial to you guys so i picked these up i thought this was really nice the base is weighted so it's it's kind of heavy the base is this part is um just like a stem and then this part here the part for your um tapered candle goes in there now it comes in three pieces and they all screw into each other so in it, the box was like a relatively small box it actually came in like an envelope the box in the envelope and it could actually fit into my mailbox so you just screw all the pieces together and you it is very weighted like i said so you don't have to worry about it toppling over even with the thin stem here so i thought these were really nice so i have those another thing from amazon that i have is this right here let me show you this one first and i was so happy to have found these because I saw in something that inspired me on online. No, it was someone's walkthrough through home goods. That's what it was. And it inspired me. And it was this these beautiful pillows. And I was like, girl, you don't need another pillow. I wonder if Amazon has pillow covers. And you know, they do. It is these beautiful faux leather camel color pillow covers they almost smelt like leather i was like wait a minute these are absolutely gorgeous if you get a close-up of them hopefully you'll be able to see the color variations in um these covers it is it's really a very nice way it's not flimsy flimsy it is the this like this this faux leather leather on the front and the back and the brand is Mandio, M-A-N-D-I-O-O. -O. This is here. If you even come up closer, you can actually even see like some of the granny. These were a fantastic deal. You received two of these. And I want to say this is like 18 by 18 the eight size 18 by 18 i think they went up to 24 by 24 and these were 16 dollars 16 or 17 dollars once again these will be down in my amazon store if you're interested but these are very nice very nice loving the quality okay 
something else that I picked up from Amazon. I picked it up earlier in the summer, but it's something I want to share with you guys because it is a very good deal. And that is this LCD projector. This projector, guys, we actually pulled it out um, for Puda's welcome home party. But I'm telling you about it. One, it's because I think we're going to be doing more things at home again. And that's fine with me. But you can also have like your movie nights. This projector, guys, was $89, $89 to $99. The picture is amazing. It has a fantastic picture. It is, um, you can use it for like your home theater teaching for an office. It's Bluetooth. You, um, I mean, it just has amazing capabilities. And I must say, emphasize again, how beautiful and clear the picture was. It wasn't grainy at all. Now there is, um, also I picked up, now it did not come from Amazon. It was actually from Sam's. Sam's had the blow up projector screen amazing deal for $129 I'm gonna put it here I have it because I, mean, well, I can't show you because it's too big and it's in the back and I can't pull it because of my arm but I will put it over here so you guys can see it these are gonna be perfect to bring out for those nice fall nights guys have a couple of people over outside have everybody kind of spaced out and have your own in-home movie we can stream everything now we have hulu if you have roku you have a um a fire stick it's movies we can stream on demand another thing that i've been wanting to do is the verses when they have the verses i want to do a verses outside and have some people over have drinks and food and things like that so i'm definitely going to be planning that but these are great to have great to have for the upcoming fall season the weather is going to be beautiful beautiful we need to capitalize on that so both of these things i am going to um link down in the description box hopefully i can, I can get a link for these um from the sams and i will have this um, vigilance LCD projector in my Amazon store and I will also link it um, down in the description box also but it will definitely be in my Amazon store okay so we have done okay that now let's go to Bath and Body Works a couple of weeks ago I went into Bath and Body Works um, they were having a sale and I needed some candles because Puda had been in my candles, of course. And so I was like, girl, we need to get you your own candle so you can stay out of my stash. And this time of year is when I definitely start to um, pull out all of my my um, fall scents. The other day, I just burnt, started burning my last summer candle and that was um summer boardwalk i think it is i love that candle but it is the perfect candle to transition on into summer with something like leaves or um something like that so i went into bath and body works and i picked up several candles here so i have two and i had a coupon also so the one candle that i that i picked up was cranberry woods and this is hopefully you can see that it is such a beautiful um glass container i love the colors now this these containers here you know you can use them over again once the candles burnt out you just clean it out use the residue candle wax and you can use that in a candle warmer and um just put you a tea light candle in here it'll work guys this candle right here it, it smells like cranberry like sweet tart cranberries on a cool fall day this is so good and i also like this very pretty copper top the other candle that i have this is whipped coffee now these this is this is a, a poodle scent she loves coffee scented candles and this one smells very nice it's, oh yes that smells very good i can smell a little bit of like a nuttiness in this one this is what that container looks like really nice and then 
this here the top of this one is gold and this one is whipped coffee it says fresh espresso whipped cream and caramel that's what i smell the whipped cream and caramel it smells very nice this one is salted butterscotch and this was i think this was a poudre candle Yes, and the other candle I'm burning in the in my kitchen. This is very nice. Salted butterscotch, brown sugar, sweet cream, and sea salt. I smell the sea salt and the brown sugar. It, it smells very sweet. Nice candle. And I think these were like buy two, get two free. And then I had a coupon. I also picked up some kitchen lemon hand soap. We can never have enough hands. So I, that was free. I had a coupon for that. And then I I picked up a Here's to You body lotion for 24 hour um, moisture, moisturize, moisturization. So this right here and that was free also. So those are all of my home freshers that I picked up from bath and body work didn't do bad on that i don't think so let's do hobby lobby was in hobby lobby and two things i saw and i was like girl do you want that i had some ideas on things that i may want and so sometimes you need to just go ahead and pick it up when you see it because you know your girl has been very bad with that so I picked up two of these um, miniature charcuterie boards, and this is by Robert Stanley. You guys have seen this. I think they've had these several years in the past, and I love how they have these. Hopefully, you can see it. It's not being, you're not being blinded by this, but you see the little charcuterie um, board they made at each place set. I think that's very cute really nice so i picked up two of these i'm gonna get some more because i picked up two because i was like is this something you really want but you know what i do because i know there's going to be a time that i'm gonna wish i had these and didn't and didn't and um now that i don't have them but you also are know i showed you guys how i was doing the charcuterie boards for my um my girlfriends, the personalized ones, but I think I might want to use these, um, these here actually for my I love my girlfriend celebration. For me to have the others will be for them to kind of take away, and I put some other things with that. But I think this may be good, so I'm gonna pick up some more of these. I think these were 40% off, so um, I think they was like 2.49 or something like that. So I thought these were cute, and the fact that you can eat off them, you can use them. Um, a variety of ways so I'm gonna get some more of these so I picked those up another item that I picked up from home goods these were my first time seeing these and I need three more so and it was these beautiful beautiful leather faux leather charges guys this is such a whiny thing this is such a whiny thing y'all if, if y'all know me, I like things that are unusual. I like a little bit of difference. And when I saw these, I already knew. Yes, girl, please get it. Don't you wait. Don't you wait. So I picked up three of these. I need to get three more, I think. And these were $5.99. I didn't, the price wasn't bad. Yeah, $5.99. And I think they were $49, 40% off. So it took off, so it made it $3.59. I've got six of them. And yeah, yeah, six of them. So I, I need to get, I think, three more. These are absolutely gorgeous, guys. Gorgeous. I tell you, my charger collection is on point. If I have to say so myself, I, I love chargers. Chargers are great because it's an easy way to uh, kind of like lay the foundation of what your tablescape is going to be. And of course, you don't have to use your chargers just around your table. You can use the chargers 
um, as the base of a centerpiece. You can have them, if it's like a very elaborate charge, you can put it up on a plant, uh, a plate stand or use it on an easel. There's so many ways to use them. But these guys, y'all know if they're going on my plate, on my table. But, um, and so I have some ideas about how I want to use those. Yeah, wait and see. Fall is around the corner. This entire area is about to change. <laughs> we are about to change up in here. And I am loving those. Okay? So we have the chargers. I went into Home Goods. Yes, Home Goods. And I really didn't see anything. Um, Home Goods, of course, has some very nice. Um, decorative items and homewares and things like that. But I tell you guys, if, if it's nothing that I am looking for particularly, or there's things that, yeah, yeah, they have things there, but it's nothing that I need, I'm not gonna get it. But when I saw these, and I have seen these um, um, many a times and at a variety of places, and, but this color, I think, is what really caught my attention. And it was, this pumpkin, hopefully you can see this, bouquet here. I think these are so pretty. Now, they're not, they're not too orange, they're a little peachy orange. And can you see like this with this? Oh my. Yeah, yeah. A real, and I have some other, some other colors that I'm thinking to put with this. But I love these. Now these were $9.99. They should have been $7.99, but these were $9.99. They're still nice. They're made of some type of, um, I don't know, like paper mache type material, I'm guessing. And they're on a wooden, like a wooden stem, dowel stem. Very nice. So I will be doing some type of an arrangement with this. And like I said, these were $9.99. So that was home good. And I think that is it from home goods. Okay, guys, we're we're almost done. Okay, let's go into Ross. Now, some of these things I've had from Ross um a couple of weeks. And I was just trying to hold I me, mean, gather things until I have enough and I thought it was enough that I can share with you. So one thing that I picked up from Ross, and I think this is gonna look great in my kitchen, and it is this very beautiful marble rolling pin and it has to stand here. This is gorgeous. Now what I would have loved, of course, if this was gold. If this was gold and not the natural wood, I think it would be beautiful. It's beautiful as is, but you know, the gold thing. But I guess because it's wood, it could be a little bit more versatile. The marble here is this beautiful um, black, like speckled type marble. It has some, some black and you see little areas of white in it, but the, the veining of this is black. Gorgeous, this is so heavy. And this is by Cooks. This was $5.99, $9.49. Oh, I thought it was five. Anyway, it was $9.49. It is very heavy. It is gonna look great on my counters. So I picked this up. And also guys, you know, this year I'm vowing to do like more baking. I'm trying to get my baking game up because you know, that that is my Achilles heel. I can cook. I can't bake except for pies. And so I want to do better with baking. I want to get out my rolling pin and get in some flour and really start doing some things like making some homemade biscuits and things like that. So we're gonna see what I can come up with with this. And like I said, it is also gonna look great on my kitchen counter. Okay, another thing that I picked up uh, from Ross and when I saw this, I was like, girl, you have gone charcuterie board crazy. You, you have just lost your mind. I have. And so 
this one right here has probably been sitting in my dining room for the longest of times. I would say probably since mm, before Puda's, um, Puda's um, party. So maybe like June. Yeah, so it's been sitting over in the corner. That corner has slowly began to accumulate and it's gotten to a point now that it's busting at the seams. And what I am talking about is this large charcuterie board. Guys, this right here is the grand dame of charcuterie boards. It is, and it was $16.99. If you guys can see that, but it was it's made by Woodard and Woodard and Charlie. It's very nice, very nice, and I know that it is going to look amazing, especially with the upcoming fall season. We can have some figs on here. We can have some apricot. We can have a lot some goat cheese, a, a variety of crackers all types of things can be on here guys and it can showcase beautifully we can also like we do some skirt steaks or things like that you can actually use this and just slice them on here and people just gonna come and get what they want oh my gosh this is such a large and in charge board and i love it so the 16.99 price tag your girl was like i don't care i don't care she wants it <laughs> and what she wants she gets <laughs> all right and so I have that we're still at Ross and I you guys know that I have collected a lot of pieces from Ross that are reminiscent of the Michael M collection and you know his collection has the gold accented like leaves and the birds which is one another reason why i said i wanted that mackenzie child's um kettle that had the bird on the top i have a lot of their pieces and you can find some um some similar pieces to his at ross as well as at home goods so i've picked up a lot of things from a couple of things from home goods i have some candles um holders i have um other like um like a candy dish and things like that that has those accents on them now the other item that i picked up from ross is this very nice it's fiddle and fern isn't this gorgeous it's a beautiful wooden piece and it has the gold um leafing and the gold stem this is gorgeous this price was $7.99. I couldn't pass it up. I just love how natural this looks. I like the the kind of white it um what is it? The the details of this. It has a very nice texture. And like I said, it is fiddle and firm. It says white with a dry cloth for decorative use only. And yeah, so I'm gonna look them up and um See if there's some more information I can find out about this. So I love this. Very cute. $7.99, not a bad price. And this is something that is definitely timeless. All right. So I have one more thing to share with you guys, and that is from the Dollar Tree. Okay, so there are actually three things that um I have left to share with you. The other one is for entertaining guys. We well, actually, Mr. B bought this Blue String Active Loud Speaker, and he got this from Brand Smart. Guys, if I tell you this will take your movie watching experience to another level, we, um, we picked this up to go um, with the movie and everything, the outdoor theater type atmosphere, and I think he got this for. 100 or 129 or something like that amazing and it gets very very loud it is um, bluetooth activated it has a lot of different mechanisms that you can also use this with so i'm gonna give you a close-up of it right over here because it's too large for me to share with you but guys definitely a game 
changer when it comes to, you know, trying to bring the actual movie experience from inside, outside, a must have. So I wanted to share that with you. And then last, well, no, not lastly, this is Dollar Tree. And, oh yeah, I do have something though. From Dollar Tree, I picked up some of these picks here. And as you see, they have the beautiful, like very muted, toned down fall colors. And then they also have the pumpkins here. I'm not sure if my light is washing it out, but yeah, this is what it looks like. Aren't these very nice? And I thought these were a great deal. I picked up five, four of these. And um, I don't have any like this. So this is great for my, my little stash of florals, especially for the fall. So I have that. And then also from the Dollar Tree, um, I have these. And I think I picked these up around the same time I picked that charcuterie board up like the end of June, the beginning of July. And I picked, I bought two of these. And this is really cute little um, um pumpkins here with the gold stem so cute now i've bought some bigger ones these actually had the candles in them from aldi's these are these have nothing in them so i thought these would be cute to kind of clean out and these will be great to hold like my sugar and also be great to hold like some salt and some pepper or something like that really good and let's see I want to, before i say that i need to make sure that is food safe it does not say but i believe let's check on the inside if it's coated on the inside and it is it should be good for something like that so i have two of those and now the last place that i'm going to share with you is ikea so i was at ikea with Puda. um getting her some stuff and I saw these and I was like girl you definitely need to get these and I need several of them actually and there are these large containers these large bins and they open up like this and so I thought this was gonna be great because all of my florals now, I think I'm gonna depending on how these work with this I'm gonna move my florals in here and label them and then I can get these out of here and possibly in the garage and just get a couple of these and label them and I can have them on the shelves in the garage and I could also have these up under my desk in my office area because that's why I do a lot of my craft and so it only makes sense to have some of those things um, accessible this was $9.99 and so we're going to see how that works um, for transporting my florals from like where they are right now into here. Some of them. And so, like I said, I might have to just kind of divide them up into like spring, summer, and fall, and fall. And particularly the fall ones that have like a pumpkin or some type of, of, of extra decorative element to them will definitely go together. The other ones, you know, you can kind of um transition them throughout the seasons so that would be good now it would be great if i had enough space to have some of these and they were just divided by colors then your girl would be doing something okay now the other thing that i picked up from ikea are these glasses that are inspired by some glasses that were at pottery barn and um, if I can find the pottery barn glasses, I'm going to put them here. These glasses from Ikea are gorgeous. And at one time, the Dollar Tree had a dupe of them. I didn't jump on that. Don't ask me why. I don't know why I didn't do it. I was just like, mm. everybody else was talking about them. And I was like, mm. don't want them. Don't need any more glasses. But when I saw these at Ikea, I was like, girl, get them. So... 
I thought, now sometimes at Ikea, you can get the entire um, carton of glasses, the six glasses for one price, right? And so that is what I was expecting. Maybe it was like $3.99 for the entire crate of glasses. I've done that before, $4.99 for the crate of glasses. So I thought these glasses were $3.99 for the crate. So I picked them up. But when I um, arrived to the register, they were $3.99 a piece. <sighs> but I wanted them and I got them and they're these. These glasses here are the bomb.com. And I was like, girl, what you waiting on? Get it. And so when, the, um, when the, the guy, the cashier, when he told me how much they were, and when he said that price, I said, what? I was like, I want them. Just, just, just go ahead. I'm gonna turn my back while you go, while you, while you go ahead and slide it on down so I can pick it up at the other end. Cause I want these. I love the shape of these guys. I mean, these are really, these would be perfect for some type of parfait, some type of dessert. Um, now these are, they, they are not the heaviest, like the thickest of glass, but it's not the thin one, the thinnest of glass also. So you should be able to entertain fairly well with these. And the great thing is, is that yes, they were $3.99 a piece, but they definitely are not the pottery barn price. So um, rest assured that um, she took refuge in this price for that because I believe if I would have gotten all six of these from Pottery Barn, it would have almost been 50 something, $60. Now, if Dollar Tree should get some of these again this year, I'm gonna get these because you always need some extra glasses to your stash. You always do. And we don't know how long Ikea will be carrying these. So I um, want to have some type of backup. So Dollar Tree, I have my eyes on you. I'm waiting for this because I would prefer to pay the dollar for these than the $3.99. A deal is a deal is a deal. All right, guys, so that's it. I told you it was a pretty big haul, huh? I think I've covered everything that I have so far. I actually have something else coming in um, today. So you guys will see that on an upcoming video um, about what I have coming in today. But make sure you come back and you check my upcoming video. It's gonna be so good, it's so good. This one came to me in my sleep, y'all. And I was like, yes, yes, girl. I think they're gonna like that, I really do. So if you enjoyed this video, you guys typically like my hauls. If you enjoyed this one, give me a thumbs up. If you're new to my, check if you're new to my channel, Hi, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. And if you like this video, and if you sat through several of my videos, what you waiting for? Go ahead, subscribe to my channel. Simply hit that subscribe button twice so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming uploads. Also, come on over and check me out on my Instagram. You can find me over there at Wani's house, just like it is here. Hit that follow button and then you will be in the know as to what is to come over here at Wani's house. Also guys, your girl's about to get back on that blog grind. It's about time now. Class is about to start and my, my creative juices have begun to flow. So it is time to get back on there. If you don't want to miss my first post, go ahead and go to my blog at Wani's House. www.wani'shouse.com. Go over there and subscribe because it's coming soon. And she's gonna have a giveaway. All right, guys, so that's it. I'm about to end this video. But before I go, you know what I always say. The next time you're in town, you can always stop by Wani's house. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.